Welcome to my custom interloper run. I'm Nifo29 and here's what's in our backpack. We're ever so slightly underweight. Uh, we're all good in there for now. Uh, lots of birch bark. I gotta, cr I gotta actually cook a couple of those and, uh, I believe a, uh, herbal tea as well. Clothing's okay. I must not eat those. <laughs> We have lots of cooked meat outside. We have lots of water. We have these carry pies, which is good. Uh, you're down to 36, but we do have this bow. So I don't know. We might. Uh, no, nah, we can't go back to the camp office and ditch it. If I ditch it, I'll ditch it here. But I think we'll end up taking it. And look at the arrows. Four and a half kilograms just on these ones. And we have others. Uh, there we go. We have a bunch of down. Uh, we are, well, actually, look at that. We're on day 200. And here's our skills. Mending is finally at five. Uh, so now it's just rifle, revolver, and gunsmithing, which, I mean, we're, we're reading a rifle book just because. Uh, whoops. <laughs> I guess I can't move my cursor up to the top right. It's uh, early morning, kind of mid-morning, 26 until boiled, um, 44, I got to do this. Sure Alright, let's, uh, let's do three. that and we'll do another herbal tea and we'll drink one of these ones now we gotta take two of these pots I mean we don't have to but I'm going to all right oh there's me walking oh look at it it's a nice day there's me walking outside with all this water. <laughs> uh, let's just drop all and Hello. take that Hi. one. <laughs> hey, Murd, welcome in. And thank you for doing that. I'm going to take these and I'll take that one. Uh, when we come back, I'll throw all that stuff in side. You know what else I want to do? Um, uh, I don't, mm, I'm going to do that. And now we only have two. There we go. We have three bars of scent. I want to try to attract this bear. I wonder if I can drop any of this here. And bring him over here. How you doing, Mert? I'm doing good. How are you doing? I see you saw the all the sound alerts. I added a, a few new ones. I don't know if any of those interest you, but what are those birds doing? Okay. Three bars of scent. Let's go. Uh, let's drink. And what's our bow at? Our 32 arrows. Where is this guy? Is this guy still, or is this guy actually available? You slept in a bad position, so your neck is sore, but otherwise you're good. And now three days off. Nice. Gotta like that. Where 
Oh, where is this guy? I'm going to gather sticks. Um, if they're in my path. I'm not going to go out of my way. I don't really need them, but... I kind of don't want to take this bear out way out here. I kind of want to have him at over by the cabin. I don't see him. Oh well. Well, we tried. It's actually pretty nice. It's only minus six. I think what we'll do now is go through the birch forest. Uh, I won't be doing a, a full scan of the area. But I'll go in a little bit and just kind of look left and right grab any birch bark that I see and head over to the pond and see if that moose is up. I mean, we're not going to get the amount of moose that we were initially hoping to get, which I think is 14. But if we can get five in total, I think I'll just be happy with that. Gotta take what it's given us, right? And hopefully, let's not get attacked today. I don't know if there's any wolves around, honestly. I mean, we took out a bunch yesterday. What is our wolf count at, actually? We don't have a, a quota or anything, but 276. 22 bears. 3 moose. Uh, deer and rabbits don't count. I've only actually killed one rabbit. <laughs> that must have been early on. Not really a bunny killer myself. Uh, is it still? It's it's warming up. I'm gonna walk into the house and gonna just walk right through it. Warm up a bit. And this pack is getting kind of heavy. Do I? I don't have anything that I can throw downstairs, do I? No, I don't. Uh, everything in there I gotta kinda take. Uh, I can make an arrow shaft. Or, uh, sorry, an arrow. Not just an arrow shaft. I already have arrow shafts. I don't really need another arrow, but... Whatever, it's 45 minutes. Must do that. You don't see your toolkit back out and go back in, and it should appear. You go up there. Now we got 33 arrows. I got stuck on that box again. Uh, let's just go out here. Three bars of scent. Let's duck. Uh, what was the... Okay, it's still before midday. Yeah, we'll just... Uh, like I said, we'll just go by the birch forest, grab whatever birch we can actually see. Without scouring the area. We'll go check the moose spawn. And... I wonder if right from there, if we just, 
head over to Timberwolf Mountain. Ten days in Timberwolf Mountain and no moose. You feel ripped off heading to Coastal Highway for some beachcombing and you're planning on filling each fishing hut there with fish, fish, and lots of fish. Ten days in Timberwolf Mountain and no moose. How many uh, feathers? Eight. Now we have nine. What was that right there? Was that... It's, it's hidden by the hill, but was it just a, uh, a carcass? I wonder if maybe it was the bear. I don't even remember where the bear was. Something bad happened here. Wow, did we summon the crows the past few days or what? I'm gonna head towards the forest. I think it's warm enough. It's minus four. Or at least it feels like it's minus four. No point wasting any time going in and warming up. Okay, I'm gonna try and see what did I see? What is that? What is that? There's some wood or something. I think that was the bear. Possibly. Yeah, I think that was the bear. Well. We heard a wolf howl, so there should be a wolf somewhere around here. Seeing one though. Brother Maynard, bring up the holy hand grenade. <laughs> I, I like that one. I don't. I don't even know what it's from, but I just. I heard it one day, and I thought, yeah, I need that one. And we'll see how YouTube likes those ones. They didn't like my baby shark one. Oh, uh, this better not turn into a blizzard. It's not even snowing, but... Yeah, it's... A lot colder all of a sudden. Oh, uh, listen to that wind. All right, so we don't even have any birch bark, right? I don't even know. I mean, we might find a couple. This is kind of what I meant. I'm just going to go a little ways in here and then just kind of side to side it. Oh, well, we got one. Um, if I miss any, I'm not really terribly bothered. We have a lot. Um... A lot for what I would normally carry. Uh, the only time I think I'll actually search for it after this is if I have an odd number, I'll look for another one just to make sure I don't end up with an odd number. Nothing. What are we at? We're at three. Okay, I need one I more. I hate being cold. There we go. Yes, I really do. 
You have 35 prepared birch bark. Is that overboard? Nah. What do I have? I have 12. <laughs> uh, the game, you know the game's gonna make me find one up here. And you know, like, obviously I can't not look, right? We got a deer over there, a little doe. Alright, that's what I didn't really want. I didn't want to get cold. Uh, is it coming left to right? I think. Where's our breath? And yeah, it's going that way. All right, I guess it's kind of going right to left. If I go up here, will I be able to see the pond? Oh, oh man. I instantly saw movement and said, my brain just said instantly, it was like moose. Nope. That deer is going to need to grow a little bit to become a moose. Can you imagine if, uh, if deer were just juvenile moose? <laughs> Obviously they aren't. But what if they were like caterpillars? They start off as deer. Build a little cocoon. Boom. Moose. <laughs> but then we wouldn't have moose babies. And moose babies are so cute. It's all legs. <laughs> You've taken the moose out from that area where I was up on that hill. Nice. A good spot. Run. I actually have a peak. What's in front? Nothing. Okay. Oh, See, now this would have been a good spot and time to come in here and craft an arrow. Although we don't have a red toolbox. Oh well. Alright, well I guess uh, what are we gonna do? We're just gonna read the book for an hour while we warm up. There we go, and let's, you are cooked, let's eat you. That's only 0.38. We will eat that one. And we will fill the bladder. Let's go, it's time, it's just after midday. Do we still have three? Yeah, we do. Wow, I didn't really hear what direction that wolf was at. I didn't doll my pies. <laughs> you didn't see I left the majority of them at the uh, farmhouse. I brought one in case we got a moose. But that's actually a good reminder because I was thinking about just like from here, just going over to Timberwolf Mountain. But now I'm thinking, wait a second. I might want to go get those pies. I didn't make all those pies so they can sit on the floor outside the farmhouse. I 
Some crows about to fly overhead. I wonder... I'm gonna want to grab some... Uh, I'll, I'll probably actually drop the uh, the raw meat. Grab a liter or two of water. All of the carry pies and I don't know, like six kilograms, possibly. What's our weight? 45. Mm. Would you like to lay with your friends? Today's word is abrogate. What does abrogate mean? I, I want them right there. Oh, come on. All that time. I stink. Did he like reach the limit? Okay, he's still coming. Well, that's not exactly where I wanted him, but it's... Oh, look at that. I could get all of it. You know what? What's the wind? It's minus 12. Zero on that. Oh. So abrogate means to abolish by formal or official means annul by an authoritative act repeat to abrogate law interesting drop all that uh you know what we can cook that need a chunk of coal on there i don't need this i really don't But there's like four here. Let's take them. Just because... We can also have a fire. I'm just taking the meat. We don't need no guts. Uh, and I, I didn't even pay attention to how long. I don't think it's taking very long to harvest. But, what is that, 18 minutes? 12. Alright, I think, uh, well, let's have a peek real quick. We should have six minutes. So obviously that last wolf is going to be bigger than a six minute harvest, but You're five. How long are you? 20. Barely, it doesn't even look like it's cooked. I, I'm not a fan. Ever since they changed the visuals on the meat, I don't feel that it was a good change. Hey, Zach the Fulfi, welcome in. How are you doing? Hey, Mr. Coach, welcome in. I didn't even notice you there. My wolf hunting permit here in Pleasant Valley is hereby abrogated. Why? I was doing good on them. I might eat that pie. I yep. I will eat the pie. Uh, you know what else I'll do? Ah, it's, I'm not, I'm not wasting a coffee for like 0.6 something. Airy capacity.
That's a good haul right there, though. What did we get? We got seven. Twelve. Sixteen kilograms. Yeah, no bear for an IFO. I don't... It, it's just, like, I don't know that these ones are even awake right now. That guy will be gone for a while. Oh, with uh, with wolf and bear meat, you're part way there to making stalker pies. What am I missing? Probably potatoes and carrots. Or oil. I have... I, uh, do I have potatoes and carrots there, or is it at the uh, community hall? I don't remember. I don't know. What does stalker pie do for me? Is it one of those stupid pies? It's like, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna give you this benefit, but we're gonna reduce your carry capacity because. Eating always does that, right? Oh, okay. Point f uh, point 0.5 bear meat, point 0.5 wolf. Salt, oil, and acorn ground. Yeah, not going to happen. I really hope that they revise the acorns because that's it's right up there with Canadian money as one of the dumbest things in this game some people like it though I actually I, I mean I'm just one person so I don't like it increased stamina decreased carry weight right, right there that's the dumbest thing ever Improved rest. Alright, since we're going in, I'm going to drop the wolf meat probably right here. Even though this is basically where I throw all my other stuff that when I walk out of the cabin and I've forgotten. <laughs> And all the wolf meat, yep. And this is uncooked bear meat. There we go. You're cooked, you're cooked, and you're cooked. Uh, that puts us at 57. What am I missing? Oh, the water, that's why. I was wondering why, 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 why am I heavy? This pack is getting kind of heavy. I forgot. I forgot. Alright. Let's throw this water down here. I think just two more. Come on, turn green. There we go. Okay, where are we at? 51. That's not going to work. Uh, I don't need all of these flare shells, honestly. I need my flare pistol and maybe that. Which together is one kilogram. And that is a whole nother kilogram right there. Uh, I'm going to leave them in here. Yeah, let's do this. Flare shells are another thing that really doesn't need to have a condition on it. Uh, oh, damn it. I'm carrying all of this. 
I literally brought that over. I, I kept gathering it. Just, I, I, I don't even really know why. I honestly don't know why. Three and a half kilograms of something I did not need. That's ridiculous. Okay, well, let's, uh, craft up this birch bark. We only got two. If they removed a step or two from acorns, it would be so much better at, but as is, it's annoying. Yet you still get them and make things. <laughs> yeah, I don't. I, uh, it's that thing though, right? It's, it's, everything's got to have a positive and a negative to it. But I just think that the negative associated with acorns The negative being the amount of steps it takes um, and the time. Oh man, I just, I don't like it. Okay, all of this meat is cooked. I will eat that one because it's a partial. Yeah, I really don't like the meat textures. has been made that flare shells are here just in case you need them. Okay, thank you. Oh, we... Uh, I don't think it's gonna last. We're at 4505, so we can take what we have. Yeah, there it is. It's done. I briefly got excited about the potential of looking for a cache. Okay, because of the time of day, I'm just going to read that for an hour. I'm actually going to read it for another hour. There we go. And we have six hours left on that book. All right. I guess we're off to Timberwolf Mountain. Unless we come outside and miraculously. I want to see something. I'm going to pick all these up. That should be more than enough. I'm going to pick you, you, I I can drop you. Gear. I want to see. I'll take one of you. Take a thing of bear meat. And you're right there. All right. Can't do that. Canned corn. Oh, man. Yep. I'm going to call it off right now. <laughs> That's all I needed to see. I don't care. I don't care. I've never been a fan of the recipes. Y'all can like them all you want. I hate them. Oh, now you're not going to go in? Alright, let's just pick you guys up and move you. Actually, no. We'll throw you down right here. A to Z. I think if they had a system where you could craft... Uh, like, like there's a mod for seven days to die where you can craft from, uh, your, your storage bins. You don't have to pick everything up. That's the thing I hate the most. Right, you're ruined bear meat. See, look at the difference between these two. It's, it's, it's like so hard to tell the difference. Like it's so subtle. All right, that's all of it. Let's go.
But yeah, if they had if they if they had something where like you stored or you had your 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 meat all on the floor in the kitchen and allowed you to just craft or cook your your food that way. from the vicinity uh, I, I think I would like the recipes a little bit better I don't like having to pick up everything uh, I have a terrible memory as you know so I'm not ever gonna remember like oh okay I need this and this and this and this my thing is more like what you just kind of saw just pick up one of everything and see if it lets me do anything Okay, I got my pots. But that was one thing. I mean, the, this game has always been, in my mind, uh, uh, more of a simplistic survival game, I guess. I don't mean that by any means in a bad way. I mean, like, some survival games are far too intricate. This one was always more basic. And... I don't know, maybe I'll disagree, but the recipes to me are not basic. Might seem stupid, but it's just... I never, I never thought that they were required to begin with. But it does give people options, I guess. And that's good. And people like me don't have to use them. So it's not like they're forcing me to use it. I like that. I like when they add things, like not just Hinterland, but any developer. When they add stuff into the game that you don't really need to use. But people who like it or want it can use it. I like when they do that. Give you a choice. And we're going to go right through this and we're going to find one piece of birch bark. <laughs> you know it's going to happen. You know it. So when we get into Timberwolf Mountain, I believe we have that close moose, right? And yeah, you can see the birch bark right now. Okay, there's two. We need sticks as well. I also, what are we at? 44, 16. What are we at now? 44, 26. Okay, that doesn't add that much weight. Uh, I guess we'll jump into the cave to warm up real quick. Just read an hour of the book and carry on from there. Really? Well, it's not going to happen, bud. We are leaving. You make so many camber flight porridge. They're your travel food, so you don't want... You don't move a boat with scent, plus vitamin C, 1200 calories. Only have sent when taking coastal fish cakes. I'm a good old fashioned meat and potatoes guy, but we're not allowed to eat meat and potatoes. Well, I guess you technically can. It's just not one meal, it's like two. <laughs> There's your meat. <laughs> There's your cooked potato. may seem foolish to y'all but that's what i wish one of the ingredients or one of the recipes was something just basic like that here any one of these chunks of meat along with potato and carrots there you go you can have it either as a steak version or you can have it as a stew Maybe one day. 
I doubt it, but maybe. Alright, let's jump in here. Um, you've been red. Funny. Oh. You know what that was, right? <laughs> that was them damn pies. I knew as soon as I started dropping and I heard quiet sounds. Oh, damn it. <laughs> you knew it was bound to happen. That's exactly why when I went out looking for the moose in Pleasant Valley, that's exactly why I left all of them except for one. Now I gotta pick these stupid things up. And drop them all again. Oh, they're in they're in their own piles. Okay. I take it back. I don't have to pick them up. And I'm sorry for calling them stupid. <laughs> Pie complaint number one for the day. <laughs> Come on, it can't only be me. Right? They should just stack in your inventory, regardless of how you've dropped them. Or, you know, that's it, right? They're, they're either stacked or they're on the ground stacked. This garbage of like, oh, you dropped them that way, so they're all gonna be individual. I don't even know what happened back there, though. Like, I don't know why they're stacked. I think they should have went individual, shouldn't they have? And then I would have to drop them again from my backpack. And then they would go... I don't know. The, on all honesty, that might actually be the intended way, right? Like, it might... They, they, the way they're actually operating might not be the right way. Uh, I'll be the first one to say, I don't think they need to fix it ASAP. Like, it's not a, it's not a game-breaking annoyance. It's just like, uh, damn it, I did it again. Oops, I did it again. <laughs> oh, Jesus. That guy scared the ever-loving bejesus out of me. You hear the chimpanzee? I'm not even calling them crows anymore. I'm just going to call them what they are. That's a chimpanzee, damn it. Come on, bro. You saw me. Let's see if this guy's fixed. Will he come up here properly? We're gonna have to chill out right here. We got only one bar ascent, but he saw us. So... That's not even the first time that guy spooked me like that. <laughs> I've had a couple of times coming up that direction and like, boom, there's a bear. Like, wait. This is going to be a little bit of a wait, but I don't want to go any further because he may lose interest. I don't even know if he's interested right now. We shall see. Yeah, he lost his interest. Does that mean he's not able to come up here? I'm doing this. You know why? Because of that stupid bear by the farmhouse or the barn. 
That just insta charged me. What was that? Was he bluffing there? I went up on this. <laughs> Damn it, I can't see. Sure getting cold. Now is this gonna cancel him coming up here? What other one can I climb on? I wonder if there's a way of getting onto this tail section. I've never actually looked. <laughs> Looks like he's coming up. We did this last time though. We thought he was coming up and then he just got stuck. Stuck. In an area. This guy used to come walk through here. If you had scent, you could bring him right in. I think he gave up. The problem is I have to put myself in danger to find out. Well, you know what? I'm at this point, I'm not really interested in going after him. We don't need him. Uh, he will... Going after him will burn the rest of this day. And... I kind of want to get to Timberwolf Mountain. So yeah, it would be interesting if that guy can actually go back up there again. It doesn't look like he's completely fixed. I remember for the longest time, I always thought that was a safe zone because I hadn't seen the bear up there and then I saw somebody else playing and the bear was up there and I'm like, what? And then we had him trying to go up. Big, fat, juicy buck. All right, let's uh, put that away. We got a rock, you know what, here. I want this. the invisible bear is what's classified as fixed this bear must be fixed as well hey I did this I did this that used to be mine well it still is mine I'm gonna leave it there because honestly I don't feel like pulling the sled kind of feel like just getting into the bunker and warming up. Same deal, we'll just read the book for an hour and then we'll go. Right, we should be fine, let's run. I'm gonna have a peek right here and see what we have. There's a couple of Raishis right there. Uh, we're only going to have four hours left on this book. Let's go.
Way up there. Just past midday. So yeah, we're gonna... The destination is to go up the rope again and go check that cave where I usually throw all the boots. Um, that will be what we're doing no matter what. I don't care if we see boots in the Mountaineer's hut. I don't care. I want to go up there anyways. Just because it's an area you don't really play in. You go there once or twice when you're doing the summit. But then you don't really go there and hang out. There's all those deer up there. There's a few wolves. Or at least one anyways. And then there's also a bear. But mostly I just want to go in there and check out... What did I leave in that cave? I know there's probably like uh, things I don't need, like blue toolboxes and such, but there might still be some some leather items. We shall see. We also might get sidetracked by a moose. Who knows? And what do we got? One bar of scent. I don't know. It one bar shouldn't be enough to, to bring a wolf into that area, but I guess it doesn't hurt to have the bow out just in case, right? wants to stretch. That long straight area I was just walking in wasn't good enough. Alright, if I get attacked this is on you. There we go. Thanks Merc. <laughs> There we go. Alright, let's put that away. I don't see any uh, wolves. I'll peek over this hill for a moose. See him. I just, I, all I hear is crows. Oh, did you see that? He just appeared. Well, that's unfortunate because I wanted to go up to the upper. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> I, I don't think we're in a position where we can bypass any moose anymore. We did it one time and now we regret it. We must. This is the one that stomped me. The only one. There's his markings. Um, I think I had success that one time when I climbed up on this. I think it was this one. I hope it was this one. 
I've already taken this guy out. There's my fire to warm me up. <laughs> right underneath the... Can I see it? There it is. You can just barely see it. How high can I go? Can I go right to the end? I don't know if I want to because... It might put these branches in the way. Alright, we have 33 arrows. 33. Oh, that was too low. And that's that. <laughs> now we gotta wait an hour for him to get back into an area where we can take him out. This would be right where we took a took a shot at him before. Let me do that. Way over there. I don't think I can climb that. I kind of wish I had a rock, to be honest. Remember when I had a rock and I chucked it at that deer? Uh, I don't feel safe if I'm not on that arched tree. Uh, thanks for the one birch bark hinterland. We know this is a dangerous area, but we'll give you half of the ingredient to make something that'll help you out. I think there's another one right there and another one. Oh, I can get up here. We might be able to ambush them. We'll just jump on top of them. Break them like a wild horse. Oh, hello. Oh, stop, please. Please don't move. Please don't go into a spot where I can't get you. Oh, I couldn't draw quick enough. Is he coming up here? Hello? <laughs> okay, now what's uh, the game plan now? Okay, that arrow sounded like it broke. Yeah, there it is. Uh, did they put any rocks anywhere around here? I can get them to run this way. that somebody plays smart and brings their own rock. I think I'm going to go back up here. I think I liked it. It was safe. Um, it's safe because you just drop down to there and he can't get you, right? So you're not really stuck in a situation where once he does come up here, now it's on. Like some, some of those are. He's way over there. Let's, uh, eat some meat. How many, uh, birch barks do we have? We have just two made. Whatever, I'll just eat one. 
eat one, I'll drink one. Yeah, I really need a rock. This little ridge is safe or not? It might be. It also might be a death trap. That should be safe. Okay, I can just jump down there, but I need him closer. Uh, if I've had all my 400 flares, I could always fire a flare in his area and that would be enough to get him to run. I feel he's too far away right now. And one thing I don't want to do is have to go hunting for all my arrows that I was just hail marrying at him. Come on, I gotta come this way. Yeah, there's a piece of birch bark right there, it looks like. That, no, that's that fire. That's where I took him out before. Um, uh, what's the time? We got a... We ain't got all day. There's another perch park. Yeah, I just don't know the distance, like the, the height I have to shoot. Oh. That's me bowing. Got a moose, got a moose. Will you do the fandango? Boom headshot! Boom headshot! Boom headshot! Got him. We took him. That's what they call it in the hunting world. He was taken. I'm need to rest soon. And let me just say, how efficient was that? There's only one in there. Okay. How efficient was that? I can probably use this fire. Oh, I might be able to. Right, you are going to have to go. Right there. Um. Aha. I learned my lesson. Okay, I only have three of these, so let's just do that. Um, the cold is making my head feel thick. Get a fire check for the mag lens. Nope. So now Nifo is going to be hunted I'm by Liam Neeson because of the whole taken thing. <laughs> nope. No, I just know that when I go to Cabela's, it's like, you know, they have all the animals there and it's like taken on this date. No, you mean he was killed on that date. Taken is when you actually taken the meat out, in my opinion. Oh, my God. That was my lazy finger. Accidentally cancelled. I have my hand off of my mouse now. Right, that's an hour. There we go. Look at that. I don't care who you are. That's efficiency right there. 
using the same fire I used on the previous one. Do that. Hey, what happened there? Okay, what do you got? 20 minutes? Five. We'll take five. You did, copper. Welcome in. How are you doing? Oh, please, wind. Please don't pick up, please. Fifty-eight. All right, we got seven. We got thirteen kilograms last time. Was per per cooked duration, right? So. Seven and six works. Now uh, it was on the fire 43. Okay, it's still good. So we'll throw those in there and we'll take six this time. Last time we did eight and five, but I wanted to shorten it up a little bit because I don't know how long that fire is going to keep going. Twenty nine minutes. That might be enough for that to cook. How's our meat and water? Our food and water is good. All right, we'll take five. Oh, that fire might blow out now. That looks a lot stronger wind. You smacking your lips for Astrid. Oh, it's still going. 16. I am going to throw... I don't care. Throw a couple of those. Oh, that's too bad. Okay. I wanted to see if I can get a wind block. Let's take the hide. You're a bit better, but falling asleep in the sun on the couch. <laughs> well, it's good that you're a little bit better. Alright, let's do that. You know what? Let's just do this. It's only minus one. On the wind. Oh, I have a wind block. What was giving me a wind block? The fire? I don't know. We are kind of down a little bit of a hill. I don't know if that's giving us a wind block. Drink that. Right. We'll see. How cold will it get once that fire? It's out now. Not that bad, actually. 
I just want to make sure I don't have any meat. Okay. Um, this is going to suck. You know what? I need my light. All right. And I can't throw the meat. You know what? I can throw that one. You're only 2%. I don't trust throwing any of that in there, to be honest. We do have one bar of scent. Let's do that. All right, let's go. Uh, I wasn't smart, was I? I didn't aim it towards where we're going, did I? I just kind of put it down. Yeah, that's where we're going right there. I'll take you. I don't trust this. Thank you for continually putting that thing right dead center on my screen. I don't trust coming up this hill. I am very worried about being attacked. Uh, we do have one bar of scent, so I mean... We haven't been here for a while. It is possible there could be a wolf already on its way this, this way. And heavy snow, and I can't see. Yeah, I don't like this at all. I mean, worse is that there could be even a bear already on his way. Can I get up this way? That's where Murd says, can I get up this way? Time number seven. <laughs> oh, I can. Let me turn this baby around. Well, that's far enough. Where are you? I'm going to have to leave some of the scare behind. Worst thing to do ever is that. Picking everything up so you can't move. Okay, right, let's go. Let's get in here. Alright, we can put that away. I don't see any boots in here, so maybe I didn't bring them. Maybe. But y'all can go there. Um, you're a good bow, honestly. Somebody's been here. Where did I not have a moose hide? Is this not one of them or is this the moose I bypassed the one time because I was, I was on my way somewhere else? How many is that? Six. Oh, you're going to try taking my meat? Do I have a rock? See, I also think that, you know what, if I leave the door open, I think I should be at risk of, of the animal coming in. Hey, I have a couple of these here. You know what? Where are you? 
He did. You bugger. He took my meat. Just go inside. I don't know where he is, but yeah, when there's footprints going right to you. Oh, I used the moose hide to make the satchel. Okay. Forgive me if they're not remembering that. It's not something I tend to do. Eighty-five years. Yeah, when there's footprints going right to your meat, that's what that means. They took it. Harvest that arrow. Uh, we gotta get to bed. Let's drink some water. Do it. But yeah, I think if your door is open, I think you should be at risk of the animal coming in. If it's closed, I don't think they should be able to break it down, but... I do wish that was a thing, like... How much water did I have? Do I need more? No, I don't. I have lots. Water. Oh, do you? We think alike, Astrid. You are cooked. Take that. Um, let's go over here. There we go. They're all at zero now. Oh, <laughs> I'll take that back. spread this out when it's in a pile it's hard to see what they took yeah, let's get in here oh did I leave the lantern on outside If only I had another lantern. <laughs> Did I have oil in here? That's not, I don't usually put oil in there. I usually put oil down here. Well, luckily we have a blizzard and we need to pass time somehow. Oh man, I legit left it outside while it was lit. You know, if you wouldn't have said anything, I wouldn't have known and I would have just picked it up and we would have been on our merry way. Then we would have got to a cave and I would have been, dang it. Are we gonna get all of them? Oh yeah. Thanks for killing that day. Alright, how much did we get? Three liters. Three out of 350. What the hell does that mean? It can carry a maximum of 350. That's what that means. Dunce. There we go. Two out of 250. What the hell does that mean? What's this number mean? I don't get it. There's that one. Um, let's... Yes. Alright, I gotta get rid of... What is in here? Hand up for this.
Sorry, I was sneezing. My eyes were closed at the time, so maybe you saw my mouse jump. Maybe you didn't. I don't really know. But that's what the reason was. Alright, I don't need to carry all of this lantern fuel. I'm going to drop the full ones. I have five bottles of oil, which can hold 250, 2.5 liters. All right, I guess that makes sense. That makes sense, I guess. I'm going to try it. It's just kind of confusing. You. You know why? Because look at you. You weigh 0 0.10 and you have nothing in you. Um, I'm going to have to move you guys here. And I'm going to put that empty one away from these ones so I know. Last thing I want to do is come here one day and be like, okay, good, I have oil. And it's just like the empty one. There you go, Mr. Bug. You can go there. Actually, you can go like that. All right, now what do we have? Uh, we have 12 sticks. We're all good there. Clothing's all pretty good. We still need leather. So we're going to, I think, I think we're going to go up. Um, we should have a lot of alertness, right? Yeah. Turn it on for one second to get rid of that nasty zero one. I'm going to... Okay, that didn't work. Because it's full. Because I've had... At least it's telling me that the lantern is completely full. I've had it where you've seen that, where it would only fill it. Yeah, it still won't do it. I've had it where it will only fill that to 0 0.99. And that's highly annoying. Let's go. Oops. I wish I knew where I shot that. F Dang it. Where I shot. Oh, that's part of that. Okay. I wish I knew where I shot that flare. Every once in a while you've seen it. You probably had it happen for yourself. More than an actual second. <laughs> Bloody hell. Well, you said light it for a second. You sound like my previous supervisor. It's not what I said, it's what I meant. <laughs> I want that. I, I'm okay with it. At some point we'll come back. Do I hear a bear? I hear a chimpanzee. Yep. Oh wow, where the hell did he come from? He just like casually comes out. Like, yeah, I was burrowed under. I don't know that he was burrowed under. Maybe you guys saw him over here. I didn't. Is this actually safe? Is this safe? I think it's. It might be safe, but it ain't nearly as safe as that fishing hut. No, this way, bud.
You love Timberwolf Mountain. You love that the fishing hut is so close to the base. Yeah. Thing is, do I want to lure him over here? Oh, we got a wolf out there. Or do I want to... He, he's, he's already headed in the direction of the cabin. What happens when you hit a bear with a stone? You get charged, I think. You try it in your game and let us know. <laughs> I don't remember if I loaded my pistol, my flare gun. You are loaded. Run, little dear. Okay, I know I probably asked this a billion times. Am I safe under here? I know where I am safe. I'm safe on top of it. Kinda. Hey, bud. This way. You don't want to try a knife? Oh, just curious out loud. Um. Oh, I missed. Okay, now I'm out of rocks. <laughs> oh, bugger. this way does that instantly make me invisible That is bear 23. Oh, look at that. He didn't. He's not gone. He is not gone. He's still here. This snow pile is screwing everything up. I think. I hit him right here. Hit him. There's another one. Oh, please drop dead over there. Starting to feel numb. Can you imagine if he ran at my cabin and just dropped dead right in front of it? That would have been way too amazing. Let's go in here and warm up, I guess. All right, he's bear 23. He's got three arrows in him, I believe, right? I don't even remember how many I have. Um, what's our clothing like? Can we do a repair instead of reading a book? 18 minutes 29 percent on that sewing kit what do we got you're 55 you're 25 let's swap those all right let's uh Let's drop the meat. Eat that piece. And let's go. 
Oh, actually, before we go, whilst we warm up, let's make sure he's down. Problem is, it's too windy to to know where. But luckily, we can track him. See, now here's I don't know how this is going to operate, but if there's tracks visible they should lead right to him but also it's snowing so my thoughts are also like if it ever is snowing and there's tracks they they kind of should disappear oh there you are earlier than normal what is the temperature it's minus five did we not take him out earlier up here? I got two arrows. I meant to click way up there. Somehow I hit his hitbox. Oh man, you're going to be a royal pain in my butt. I'm on a slope. Are you gonna, I'm going to end up getting a broken ankle here. Have you ever broken your ankle? Whilst harvesting? <laughs> Let's find out. I'm going to take seven at a time. Should be three arrows unless one broke. Right. And now the problem is how far I don't want to have to run down the hill every time I harvest a little bit of meat. Oh, son of a bitch. Oops. <laughs> I was thinking, oh, hey, I, you know, oh, I did not just cancel that. I hate myself right now. Well, at least people aren't able to micro harvest. You know, that's the main thing, right? Like screw in all the player bases. A side thought, isn't it? Get that handful of people cheating in their single player game. Because the big guy doesn't like it. I forgot I had pies. I remembered that I dropped them all. And then I forgot that I picked them all back up because they were all the same percentage. <laughs> When I dropped them, actually, the intent was actually just to leave them all. It's getting dark out here. Gotta look for shelter. But yeah, they turned out to be all at zero. So I thought, oh, they'll go in one stack. Just take them. 14. I'm going to take it. I'm just going to take 14. I don't care. It's it's nice weather. Yeah, no kidding, right? There's probably a mod out there that allows you to micro harvest anyways. I'll never really fully understand why. I mean, I ranted about it before where like, you know, if you if you feel somebody's found a way to cheat in the game that you made whilst in single player, why would you focus and any of your energy to fix that whilst screwing everybody else let them let them do it it's a goddamn freezing i wonder uh, you know i'm not going to be able to take all of it we're not terribly underweight 
but I mean, we're going to be at 70 or so. I kind of more interested in trying to get all of my pies. Can I even move? No. What if I eat one? Do that. Do that. Well, all right, let's try. Where the hell is it? Let's try this. This, pack is I, this is a pretty steep hill. I mean, if this thing actually goes down this hill, I'll be very surprised. I will be shocked. Let's go. Wow, look at how much condition I lost out here. I guess I wasn't really paying attention to the weather. Or, sorry, the temperature. That's my bad. Okay, you cannot go the same route that you went with the moose because... I'll end up having to drop all the moose meat right where the, or all the bear meat right where the moose meat was. And I don't want to do that. I'll go right up in here. That is good. Um, I don't like doing this on a hill, but whatever. This is so cold. I just... I want to lay down for a bit. Let's do this. Okay, let's go. Drop you guys right there. So we got another, we have a bear hide now. Oh man, all this clothing has to get out of here. It's this is not where I usually keep my clothing. Was that a pair of boots? Did I just pick up a pair of boots? I don't know what that was. I picked something up. I don't know what it was. Okay, maybe it wasn't a pair of boots. Um, yeah, this is usually where I stick my my big hides. Those can go there. Oops. And this corner is where I usually throw this crap. And we're wearing everything else. Yep. Let's go. And it's bedtime. Do that. Uh, where's... that all of it I'm gonna use the light I want to make sure I got it all, all right, we're good and luckily uh, we got enough space to take the full tea and the full birch bark And we will eat you. Oh, you agree? The hides go in the corner. It was feeling odd that I wasn't doing that like I normally do. I know, right? That's a, it, They always go in there. They always go in the corner. And for some reason, I put all those pieces of clothing in there. I don't know why, because they always go outside. All right. We need to take probably one of you. 199. That's not enough to. Oh, that's too heavy already. Well, we have to 48. You know what? And this pack is getting kind of heavy. Let's go like that. Um, there 
we go. Fill it up with zero zeros. And we'll make sure that one's got... It went through the motion, but it didn't actually take any of it. What? That normally doesn't work that way. At least when it bugs out like that, it's kind of like, you know. Why are you so far back? Why are you not? Totally that. This is time number 17 that Mert says he travels with MRE so he doesn't have scent. <laughs> I can play that game too. I, I need cooked meat. Where's my cooked meat? You're cooked venison. How much cooked meat do I have? Oh, I have lots of cooked meat. I have six and a little bit. All right, fine. I'll take you. I'll take you. I'm not sure I can carry much more. What are you talking about, Aurora? It's daytime. <laughs> Yay, I made you start to play the game. What are you talking about? Okay. Oh, there's another one? I heard a I heard another bark. Is it, was that you? Run for your life, little dare. You know I should take them out right here on the ice where it's nice and flat. This is for you, Darth. There you go. Oh, the, the, you've done this a number of times, make a number that sounds about right game. Okay. <laughs> yeah, the smart thing would have been to take that wolf out, out on the ice. Where it's nice and flat. What's my scent one? Well, hopefully we don't have a wolf coming towards us too. Hopefully there's a deer over here that'll take this wolf off her tail. That's what I'm hoping. Uh, oh, I have an even number of birch bark too. I do, I do, I do. There is a big fat juicy buck go after that guy go get him looks like another big fat juicy buck over there I get behind the tree oh I can't do it because of those stupid pies yeah I was thinking if I can break line of sight Oh, oh, he was about to go for the deer. If I break line of sight and draw... Oh, there's a piece of birch bark I missed. Whatever, I'm going to continue. Will he just give up and go after one? Uh, 
And that was kind of pointless. I'm going to get attacked because of that. I wonder if I can drop any of this gear. There. That wasn't supposed to go that way. Did I get them all? Seven? Yeah. I okay, guess. Get out of here. Stupid pie is time number three for the stream. <laughs> all I wanted there was to just drop my scent. I wanted to break. Get that. I wanted to break line of sight. Drop my scent. And just see if that would be enough to get him to go after the deer instead. Because I don't know if line of sight has anything in this game, like if it matters once they've seen you, if you break your line of sight, does it, does it, you know, I don't know what, what, how it works. But then I had those pies and with him coming that close, I didn't want to go into my backpack to drop everything. Out of fear that what if he does start to come at me? So, stupid pie is justified. <laughs> What's my weight? Why? Oh, okay. I just have to eat a pie and we'll be uh, good. Oh, good. Oh, you know what else I need? I only have three of you. I need more. There was what I need. At the very minimum, I need these three. There's only two on that other tree, so I'm just going to leave them. And we'll just get into the... I think the cave... Is where we'll head. Uh, I think it's closer. Uh, we also... Aren't in danger of breaking our wrist going to the cave as... Versus going to the uh, the bunker. What I will do though, I will run. Try to minimize, I guess, the uh, amount of condition loss. I shouldn't be picking up sticks. I gotta remain under 48. Hit time again. warmth oh look at that somebody left their stick collection in here how many do we have we have 22 how many sticks are there total I have no idea 48. So there's 26 on the floor. Uh, we want to warm up. So let's read you for an hour. All right. And now we'll eat one of you. Fill our belly. Fill our bladder. We'll drop 26 sticks. As that's how many we picked up. Now we're good. We're at 47.30. There we go.
Oh, you know what? I'm a fool. I have two stones. I don't need any, but you know what? There's a bear up there. Um, uh, we might go after him. Who knows? We might even end up going to the summit. I don't know. I mean, we're almost halfway there. I got a good mind to rock and drop these sticks and just go after the time again. What's the time of day? It's all it's mid morning, I guess you call that. where we're going right there there be the rope i don't know if we'll go to the summit but i'm not gonna say no to it i mean ultimately we're in we're in timberwolf mountain kind of to make our way to black rock but i mean we're out here uh, if I only knew how heavy you were. Hmm. Okay. Well, he's light enough to fly. The summit's great for time again. There are five spots up there for them and you can have them all up if you're lucky we already have a bunch of down though i have i left 29 pieces of down at is it i don't know if it's it's either the camp office or the uh uh trapper's cabin and we still have 11. So the main goal here is to get to that, uh, just get to that cave and see if I stored or if I still have any of the boots. Do we have scent. Cold? We do have a bar of scent. Um. Kind of stick to the right hand side make the deer run that way if there's a wolf out there maybe he latches onto one of them wolf way out there or is that that might be another deer honestly Wait. I'm so cold. I'm oh look at it. look what we have give me that <laughs> damn it to drop one all right you're all in one pile right five pies oh my god i hate this so much i really hate these things so much 
The worst part about it is they've been around for like six years already and they're still in that stupid unnecessary state <laughs> and people like me can't remember that drives people like me nuts all right let's harvest these we got lots of leather told you boots galore yeah you did and shoes too You stayed in the cave versus the plane as you don't need a fire in the cave. That's a good point. When you go to the summit, that cave's not very far. How much leather are we going to get? These are the ones I hate. You get a whole big pair of work boots and you get one chunk of leather. That's horrible. All right, let's uh, take you and eat you. Drink you up. It's almost night, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Uh, okay, I want to just make sure I don't have scent. There we go. That's only a teeny tiny piece, but... Whoops. That's not what I want to do. As much as I hate these... Oh, I don't hate these ones. That's, that's a two pieces of leather. Any of the boots that are two pieces of leather, I do not hate. I like. It's that, it's that one. An hour and a half for one piece. <laughs> that's garbage. Okay, I'm tired. That is not fair. Uh, an hour 15 for two pieces. I should just go to bed, but you know what? What's the difference? Um, if I go to bed, we're going to wake up in the middle of the day. I got to. All right. That's that little piece. Oh, what did we get for leather? 15. Damn it. Get out of here. Trying to eat the meat. All right, let's do that. Oh, look at what we have. We have all these whetstones. We have you guys. We have these that are kind of, we don't really care. All right, well, let's go. I, I hope you guys can see. I mean, I can see pretty, pretty well. Uh, let's do this. We uh, fill the bladder and yeah, we should be fine. Uh, I'll end this here. So for those of you on YouTube, if you like what you see, please like and subscribe and I will see you all tomorrow.